Good morning. Today you're going to do note cards and they are going to be over our eight new vocabulary words. We have force, contact force, friction, net force, balanced force, unbalanced force, and inertia. Your note card will look like this. You'll put the actual vocab word across the top and then you'll put the definition on one side with a line drawn in the middle and all of the examples on the other side. You will need to watch this video at the very beginning. First word is forces. Forces are a push or pull on an object. They are the act of moving an object or a person, and they are an interaction between objects. Examples would be a moving bike stops when brakes are applied, or a man pulls a door closed. Second word, contact forces. A push or pull on an object by another object that is touching it. Examples would be pushing a car up a hill, or pushing a desk across the floor, or kicking a ball. Next word, friction. The resistance of motion when one object rubs against another. Examples, friction is used in car brakes, when we walk or climb a hill, making a fire, skiing down a hill, and much more. Next word is net force. It's the combination of all forces acting on one object. An example would be a force pulling this box to the left by three newtons and a force pulling this box on this side, five newtons, which side is winning the five newtons. So the box will move to the right by two newtons. And what we did there was we subtracted this bigger side by the smaller side, five minus three, is two. Next word is balanced forces. Combined forces that form a net zero net force of zero. All this means is when a force is pulling to the left on this box by five and it's pulling by the exact same number on the other side, it's balanced five and five. So this box isn't going to move anywhere. Next word is unbalanced forces. Combined forces that form a net force that is not zero. Unbalanced is whenever there is a side pulling or a force pulling on one side that's larger than the force pulling on the other side. So the larger side's going to win. And then we're going to do the math and figure out by how much it's going to win. We would do 10 minus 5 would give us this blue side. It's going to win by 5 more newtons. Last word for today is inertia. It's the act of an object resisting a change in its motion. Examples would be a ball rolling down a hill will continue to roll unless friction or another force stops it, or one's body movement to the side when a car makes a sharp turn. Do not complete these words for today. You can stop here.